Okay, you're going to see the world's largest diamagnetic levitation device ever made. Temporary. Only took $2,600 for the bismuth and about $70 of the magnets. Here we have a 2 inch by 2 inch by 1 inch neodymium and let's see, 100 and. 60, 120, 120, 150 pounds of bismuth. <laughs> uh, anyway, here we have a one inch by half inch neodymium. Now, I don't know if you know much about magnetic levitation devices, but most of them use tiny, tiny, tiny three millimeter cube magnets. Just weighing a, I mean, it's so easy. I mean, you can just drop it and you'll never find it. This is the diamagnetic levitation equivalent of levitating an elephant. All diamagnetic levitation devices out there. I get this adjusted properly, it actually will levitate. I just need a more fancy device so I can actually adjust the screw height of both the bismuth and this, but I had it levitating perfectly a little while ago. But since uh, adjusting 100 and 150 pounds of bismuth isn't all that easy, Anyway, but you can see it levitating here. But this is the uh, diamagnetic equivalent of levitating an elephant. This is a 4.8 ounce, not gram. Most diamagnetic levitation involves a tiny three millimeter neodymium cube that just weighs just a few grams. This is 4. Point, yeah, 4.8 ounces, 4.8 or 4.7 ounces. It's a huge, huge beast to levitate. So, anyway, you've seen it here first. This is the world's largest diamagnetic levitation device. I need a little bit finer adjustment on it. Yeah, it would only cost you about mm, $3,000 to build one. <laughs> and since bismuth has skyrocketed, it'll cost you more now. Anyway, yeah, now it's stuck to the top. Getting it perfectly adjusted is hard because you're dealing with well over a hundred pounds of insanely heavy bismuth. Anyway, you can actually say you've seen the world's largest diamagnetic levitation device. I did have it levitating perfectly a little bit ago, but as you can see right now I do not have a fine adjustment device for levitating my setting my uh, lifter magnet. But it's a first this is kind of going overboard. <laughs> what does it take? It only takes it only takes 140 pounds of uh, bismuth at about 20, uh, 20, uh, six, dollars worth of bismuth, depending on the current price. <laughs>